All right, guys, we're back with Decades Week on my channel, and uh, we're gonna do 1979, and then after that, we're gonna add up all the scores for this decade. And I know we're playing Penny Ante. Penny Ante. We are my year, 1979. Here it comes, television's most exciting hour of fantastic prizes. The fabulous 60 Minute Price is Right. Come on down, you're the next contestant on The Price is Right. Welcome to Contestant's Road. The contestant with the bid closest to the actual retail price of the item, without going over, wins the item and gets to come up on stage to play a pricing game. Here's the item up for bid. An attaché and chair. From James David, a dazzling 87-inch wall system in sparkling chrome with safety-tempered glass shelves. Ideal for books, knickknacks, stereo, and studying for every room in your home. Tasha and Chair. David. Let's start the bidding. All right, what's your bid? Two one. Okay, please give me your bid. Well, Two forty-nine. And how much do you think it's worth? All right. All right. Your Two fifty-five. I'm going up there immediately. Actual retail price is. It's two ninety-nine. Here we go. Come up on stage. And we're doing penny ante, the last pricing game of this decade. You're gonna play penny ante for a thousand dollars in cash. Thousand dollars. Okay, here are three pennies. You'll have to guess the value of two items. Each time you guess wrong, you'll lose a penny. If you lose all three pennies, it's game over. Let's see the first item. Soothing, refreshing Sipacol, called the professional mouthwash. Sipacol mouthwash. First choice of hospitals and is recommended by more doctors than any other brand. Here are the possible values for the first item. Which value do you think is the actual retail price? I believe that mouthwash was 98 cents. Let's do 98 first. Is it the correct price? No, sorry, this will cost you a penny. Which value do you think is the actual retail price? 82 cents. Is it the correct price? No, sorry. Damn, this will cost not you doing a good. This is your last penny. If you don't get it right, you won't win anything, so good luck. 72. Is it the correct price? Yes, it is. Great. Let's look at our second item. Jolly Time, the popcorn with the extraordinary taste the whole family loves. It pops tender, crispy, delicious Jolly Time popcorn. Yeah, one shot at this possible one. values for the second item. This is your last penny. If you don't get it right, you won't win anything, so good luck. Jolly Time popcorn. I'm going to go with 65 cents and hope for the best. Is it the correct price? Yes, it is. Yeah, there we go. Win. Got both items. You win. So that's a thousand dollars in cash. Twelve ninety nine is the total so far. Welcome to the showcase showdown. You'll spin the wheel. If your spin or your combination of two I'll spins throw it is away, higher than the Jay. correct leader, you'll win the chance to yeah. play in the showcase. Be careful, though. If you go over one go dollar, you'll yeah. lose. If your total is exactly one dollar, you'll win one thousand dollars. My son is suspended from school. That's why I'm for a chance staying home, guys. Cash. In YouTube land. This is the current leader. Beat his score to win. It's your turn to spin. Okay, seventy-five cents. I need to beat. Thirty-five. Seventy-five. I'm forced to spin it again. You have to spin the wheel again. Even though I'm tied up with him. 
It's your turn to Force spin. Force to spin it again. No, I'm over. Ooh, 35. So we're done with this decade. Go for a dollar. Mm -hmm. Sorry, you won't go to the I showcase. did not win any showcases in this decade. So that's another $1,299. Now we're going to add all the winnings up for all the decades or all the years in the decade of the 70s. In 72, I won $568. 73, I won $3,681. And 74, I won $1,660. And 75, I won $49.55. And 76, I won $6,645. That was my best game. And 77, I won $5,163. And 78, I won $5,470. And in 79, $12.99. So, in the 70s decade, I managed to win $29,441. Okay, so tomorrow we'll be doing the 80s uh, decade. But for right now, this is Rodney127. I'm signing off saying be safe, be careful, take care of everybody, and I'll see y'all for Tic Tac Doe later on today. Goodbye.